Yeah, it's your that shit. Fucking neighbors. Fucking having a party and shit. What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Beer with Jesse. Glad to have you back. It's time for another beer review. Tonight, we're going to be drinking Duvel's Triple Hop. It is their, well, this was their last year's release of their, of their Triple Hop. <laughs> now, um, cool thing about these, uh, their Triple Hop uh, series, I guess you'd call it, the series of beers, is that they change the hops that they use every year. Last year's, which is the 2015, the one I have here, they use the Equinox Hops. Equinox hop hops. Should that be plural? I don't know. Uh, they use the Equinox hops. <laughs> so they use those hops in this beer, which gives it a more, um, well, which gives it a distinct uh, aroma and taste. I'm assuming. <laughs> I haven't had this. Um, so yeah, they change it up every year. So every year you pick this up, it's going to be different. Now, I didn't even know this. I didn't know they changed this every year. Until yesterday, <laughs> I was looking up. I was kind of checking up on this beer, so I could have something to talk to you guys about. And yeah, they they they've been doing this for a few years now, and um, as far as I can tell, they've been pretty good. Unfortunately, this is my first time trying it, so I can't really relate, or I can't really go back previous years and tell you how those were. So this will be my first triple hop from the Bell. Um, and again, this was dry hop with the Equinox hops. <laughs> so yeah, let's go ahead and uh, pop this open. Pour it into our big ass Duvel glass. Smell it. Taste it. And enjoy it, obviously. I mean, right? Let's, let's enjoy this beer. So yeah, let's pop this open, guys. Where is my bottle opener? It's like my butterfly uh, bottle, bottle opener. Look, check this out. You guys ready for this shit? Oh, oh fuck, come on. Whew. Whew. Yeah! <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh, I love this bottle opener. It doesn't bend the fucking uh, bottle caps. Oh, I guess it's bent this one a little bit. Whatever, fuck it. Triple Hop Series Duvel. This beer comes in at a 9.5% alcohol. I really hope I don't get too much head this time. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, cool. It gets out of the way. Um, that's actually fucking cool. Oh, that's perfect. Look at that. That's perfect. Fuck yeah. Now, if you guys remember from my last video, the head was up here. Now it's down here. <laughs> cool. All right. All right. Cool. Very nice. Very nice. Um, color. As far as the color is concerned, oh, it's about the same color as the regular Duval. Nice golden color to it. Straw-like little yellowish color on that. That's about a finger thick. Yeah, about a finger thick head. Nice, white, and puffy head. Um, looks fucking cool. Bunch of bubbles up on top. There's like a little cloud there. Not as much as the last uh, Duvel, the last video. But uh, it still looks great. That was a really good pour. Nice combination. See the bubbles rising right there? All over the glass, pretty much. Just kind of going up. I'm not sure if you can see that or not. But it looks really good from this point of view here. Uh, let's see what we get off of the aromas. Now... As to what I'm expecting, I'm expecting to be happier than their, um, excuse me, than the regular Duvel. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to be right. I hope I'm going to be right. And if you try have a beer, it should be happy. I mean, it should, you know, whatever. Let's check this out. <sighs> Fuck yeah. That smells good. Oh, 
Oh, fuck, that smells good. Okay. Um. Huh. That smells really good. Yeah, once again, as far as the aroma is concerned, you get some pretty strong uh, citrus notes on it. It smells really fucking good, really good. Almost like an IPA. Almost like an IPA. That smells really good. Uh, looks great. Smells great. Let's give this a taste. Let's see what it tastes like, guys. Salud. Once again, this is Duvel Triple Hop. 2015 release, dry hop with Equinox, Equinox hops, Equinox, Equinox, salute. Oh yeah. Oh fuck, that's good. Wow. Uh, oh, that's really good. That drinks like an IPA. Oh, yeah. Nice and bitter. Not too bitter. It's not too bitter. But it has a nice bitterness to it. I'm getting some... What is this? Some slight uh, grateful notes off of this, off of the hops. And it's leaving behind a nice warm sensation in the back of the mouth. This is a really good beer. Wow. Uh, honestly, honestly, this is better than I expected it to be. I was expecting something like, um, you know, I was expecting something like the regular Duvel with, you know, a slight hint of hops. That's what I was expecting. And I was wrong. Which is good, because this is a lot better than I was expected. Wow. Oh, good combination. Nice bubbly uh, mouthfeel on it. Easy drinking, which is, again, when you have a high alcohol beer and easy drinking, that's both good and bad. It's good because you don't get all the booze. And it's bad because it's going to sneak up on you. And trust me, it sneaks up on you. It gets you, man. <sighs> oh, that smells... This is a really good beer, guys. Now, as far as finding it... Well... Well, first of all, would I recommend picking this up? Yes. Yes, I would. As far as finding is concerned, I'm not sure if this is still going to be on the shelves. Again, this is last year's release. I'm not sure if they still brew it up until, you know, the beginning of this year or whatever. So, uh, I'm not sure if you'll be able to find this. Excuse me. Wow. Excuse me. <laughs> the carbonation on this is fucking good. <laughs> um, yeah, as far as finding this, I'm sure you could find it. You just gotta look for it. You know, hey, go to that liquor store I was talking about that sells expired beer. I'm sure you'll find it there. They never fucking rotate their beers. Fucking... Ah, uh, that's not wrong video, guys. Wrong video. <laughs> um, fuck. They sold me fucking a year old beer, man. What the fuck is that? <laughs> uh, back to this beer, guys. Really good beer. Really good beer, actually. And um, the cool thing about this beer is, other than it's really good, is my buddy Jimmy hooked it up with this beer. So, Jimito, thanks again, man. Thank you. Fucking, man, you have a, you're a thing for picking out good beers, dude. Thank you. Highly appreciate it. Once again, Duvel Triple Hop with Equinox, Equinox, whatever the fuck hops. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, man, I'm going to go ahead and uh, try to cut this a little short. Why? Because it's late, and I am tired. Not too tired to drink this beer, of course. <laughs> Just too tired to uh, talk about it. <laughs> um, yeah. So here's a little recap, guys. Really good beer. It looks fucking great. It's, whoa. Oh, cool. 
the head disappeared. I can see some lacing around the glass there. Damn, beautiful. Beautiful lacing on this shit. Really good stuff. Smells great, looks great, and it tastes great. Surprisingly great. I was not expecting it to taste this good. Highly recommend it if you can still find it. Like I said, depending on where you're at, I'm, you might be able to still get this. You might be able to still get this. So go out and look for it if you haven't already. I think that's going to be it for this video, guys. Thanks again for tuning in. And I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed drinking this beer. And I definitely enjoyed drinking this beer. Excuse me. <sighs> Tastes really good. I know it's late, but let's see what else is in the fridge. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll see you in the next episode. Salute. Nine point five percent. Fuck. I gotta stop buying all these. I start. I gotta stop drinking all these fucking uh, strong beers this late. Ah. <sighs> ah. Uh. <laughs>